We are at the seventh annual Craig Campbell Celebrity Cornhole Challenge, which is benefiting research for colorectal cancer. Can you talk about why this cause is, is important to you and why it's important? I first heard of the cause when uh, Craig, you know, he said, I have this charity I want to do. Anything that means that much to the friend that close to me I'm in. So I started researching, and it's such a good thing. And it, you know, it's like if you're not a, immediately affected by it, you kind of might not know it's there. But the minute you start kind of digging in, you're like, man, this hits a lot of people we know. And, and if I can help any way, shape, or cause, I'm happy to do it. So you've been doing this for a couple of years now. Have you tried to practice during the off season? I ain't got to get ready if you stay ready. Yeah, no, no. I mean, Craig's out here playing for second place. Let's be, let's be, let's be honest. <laughs> so, is there anybody that you're like, oh, besides Craig, that you feel like you got to beat today? Every, the rest of them. Yeah, Everybody absolutely. <laughs> Jimmy Allen's going down. All right. We've been talking. So I see, you I you see heard it. Jimmy Allen. <laughs> exactly. Um, so, what was it? Um, you, to talk about your new project that you've got going on. Can you talk about the journey? You talked about a little bit, you know, kind of the transition through all that. Can you talk about that journey? Yeah, you know, when you when you come to Nashville, you have this, sometimes your your vision is not seen by everybody, and they have an idea for you, and you play the games, do whatever. And I've always wanted to release my full album. I've just been releasing singles, and, and uh, you know, I said it's time. We, didn't, we, um, we left the NFR in December last, mid-December, and I just locked myself in a studio with all my people for a couple months, and we came out with 28 records, 28 tracks for the record. In the single culture right now, what is it about an album that's important to you? Well, the thing is, people don't buy albums anymore, so it's just like, I, I, and I would never put the pressure on buying records. I just want them to kind of hear what's in my head and and to come out, you know, it's everybody, you got. I feel like you have to come out with a full-length record, but I could release singles once a month for the rest of my life and be happy, but I, I just, but it's, it's something they said I couldn't do, so that's why I did it. Awesome. Thank you so much. Appreciate Thank it. Thank you. Appreciate you.